Okay, YouTube. This is d 40 with Don Shooter's Corner. Uh, coming to you, do coming to you guys again from my basement, uh, my family room. And today, what I'm going to do is what I should have done a long time ago: uh, a crony test, a crony test using my Air Force Escape UL and crony test using my Benjamin Discovery uh, 22 cal, which has been highly modified. Now, um, just to give you guys a heads up, I have my Benjamin, I'm sorry, my Air Force Escape. The numbers that I found that work best for me on the power wheel as far as uh, air conservation and power is I have this set at 11 and 13 on the power wheel so I'm not gonna you know go into detail about uh, what kind of numbers I'm getting as far as uh, speed or FPS um, I can show you that and that's exactly what I'm going to do uh, what I'll be using in the Air Force are the 25 grain I'm sorry 25 caliber Diablo Kings and these are coming in at about 29 point I'm sorry 25.39 uh, grain and what I'll be using in the Benjamin are the 18.13 grain JSBs so without further ado uh, these shot groups are going to be uh, I guess I'll do five, maybe seven shots, just to give you guys a heads up on what kind of power uh, you get from the, these rifles. Um, as I said in previous videos, my Discovery is getting 40 foot-pounds with uh, 22 grain pellets, 41.5 foot-pounds to be exact. That's, uh, that's, that's outstanding. Uh, there are a thousand dollar rifles that don't get 40 foot pounds of energy and the accuracy it goes right along with the uh, power with this Benjamin so um, I'm pretty sure I could probably uh, I could probably do field target competitions with this rifle but that's going on another another page let's get to what we came here for let me get you guys set up all right, let's get this crony turned on. And get this party started. First up, Air Force Escape UL at a power level of 11 and 13 on the power wheel. Loading up. First shot. Air Force Escape. One thousand thirty three feet per second. Second shot. one thousand fifty two feet per second now at this setting I'm getting hole on hole groups at 30 yards my backyard I have a target set out at 30 yards and I'm getting hold on hole on hole groups uh, at 30 yards at this speed or at this power level uh, third shot 1,049 feet per second. I would be doing a accuracy video as well, but uh, as you guys know in my previous videos or from my previous videos, I live in Minnesota and right now it's about 12 below zero windshield factor outside. I'm not opening a window. I'm not even going outside. 
I'm supposed to be at work today. I'm not even going to work. So, uh, at any rate, next shot. 1,039 feet per second. This is off of a exactly 300 bar or 3,000 p. I'm sorry, uh, 200 bar fill up or 3,000 psi. Next shot. 1,039 feet per second. I'll do a couple more. Next shot, 1,028 feet per second. I am just now hitting about 2,600 PSI. Next shot, 1,023 feet per second. Next shot, 1,010 feet per second. I believe that's uh, about eight shots. So, again, using the uh, Air Force Escape UL uh, at a 300, I'm sorry, 3,000 PSI fill, using 25.39 grain JSB uh, exact kings I am getting let's see here ah, I didn't even average it out sorry so you can uh, take those numbers and average them out yourself but from my uh, my calculations give me one second let me grab my phone From my calculations, in the past, I'm getting about I'm getting about 70 foot pounds of energy. I'm sorry, I'm getting about uh, 65 foot pounds of energy at these settings. So, moving right along, I'm going to move to my Benjamin Discovery. Now, if I had been using the 43 grain engines, I would have turned the power wheel all the way up. And with those pellets, I'm getting about 80 foot pounds of energy. With the 43, uh, 43 grain engines and the uh, Air Force Escape. Okay, next up, the Benjamin Discovery. Using the 18 point... One three grain JSB jumbo heavy pellets loading the first pellet taking first shot 984 feet per second second shot 993 feet per second. Third shot. 983 feet per second. Yeah. This is a 22 caliber Benjamin Discovery. Go figure. Next shot. 982 feet per second. Next shot. 968 
feet per second. Next shot, and this is off a of 2100 PSI feel. Nine hundred and sixty two feet per second. Seven shots. That's nine hundred and fifty feet per second. So I guess that'll be enough shots. At any rate, as I said, as far as the Benjamin Discovery is concerned, uh with twenty two grain pellets. Gamel pellets, I get a full uh, average FPE, foot pounds of energy, of about 41 foot pounds. With the Air Force Escape, at the settings that I have it at, I'm getting foot pounds of energy with the uh, 25 grain, I'm getting about 65 foot pounds uh, with the 43 grain engines. If I turn the power wheel up uh, all the way to 13 max settings, uh, I'm getting about 82, 83 foot pounds. That's all right. I'm I'm not uh I'm not complaining. So this is Don with Dwight Rec 40 with Don Shooter's Corner. Sorry about the crude video, but uh, I was just sitting down watching YouTube and realized that I haven't really giving you guys a uh, crony video uh, for the new rifle and I've made some claims about this rifle getting 40 foot pounds and never actually uh, did the video for that so this will this will kind of seal the nail in the coffin or give you guys uh, the truth behind the statements so to speak so again d -Rick 40 Don Shooter's Corner, Air Force Escape, Benjamin Discovery, 22 Cal, Crony Test. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a good one.